Hey guys, welcome back to Brown's Math Club. Today's topic is inserting zeros when adding or subtracting decimals. This is, I know this is a very long title, but what it really means is that when you're adding or subtracting decimals, sometimes you come up with problems that have some digits missing and it's sometimes a little confusing. So that is when you can insert zeros to make it easier for yourself to add or subtract. And remember that zeros have no value, so it's not really going to change anything in your problem. It's just going to make it easier for you, okay? So today I'm going to first go ahead and do adding decimals and show you when you can add insert zero so, so that will be easy, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and do the problem 5.4 plus 2.364, okay? Now I have this problem, as you can see, I am missing two digits in my problem, which is on top of the six and the four. Now, some of you may find it easy just to add it like this, but for those of you who have a little trouble because it's, it may, I mean, for me, even it is a little confusing because when you don't have any digits, you can sometimes be like, okay, is this right or am I doing it wrong? Or So that is when you can insert the zeros to make it easier for yourself. So remember, zeros have no value, so it's not really going to change anything in your problem except it's just going to be easy, okay? So add the two zeros on top, and now what you're going to do is simply add. So remember, 0 plus 4 is 4, 0 plus 6 is 6. 4 plus 3 is 7, bring down the decimal point just as it is, and 5 plus 2 is 7. So that means your sum is 7.764. And the zeros didn't really make any difference, except it was just a way whole, it like a lot of easier um, way to do it, okay? So that's that for adding decimals. Now what if we had a different problem that had to deal with subtracting? And I mean, it's still... It's pretty much the same thing but except sometimes it can be in different digits okay so let's go ahead and take the number 7.64 minus 2.3 okay now in our addition problem we had digits missing on top this time we have them missing in our bottom number which is right underneath the 4 okay so now what you have to do remember insert a 0 and now the 2.3 becomes a 2.30, but remember, it doesn't really change the value of our number, okay? So now if we just go in and do some simple subtraction, 4 minus 0 is 4, 6 minus 3 is 3, bring down the decimal point just as it is, and 7 minus 2 is 5, and we get our difference of 5.34, and it was really easy as long as we inserted the 0, and I hope you guys understood this topic. Now remember, you can visit our website at broincismathclub.com for extra practice problems on this topic and also further coming up topics, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye!